right, uh, welcome back to Halftime Report on CNBC TV 18. For now, let's get to talk about some stocks. By the way, Tech Mahindra is the one that's really surging, 5.5% higher now on Tech M. But Aurobindo Pharma is uh, in the news as well. Ekta, why is that? Well, yes, uh, there's positive news which is coming on Aurobindo Pharma where APL Health, which is uh, the company's arm, Two of the units which are housed in that particular arm, Unit 1 and Unit 3, were inspected by the US FDA. This inspection took place from the 9th to the 18th of January. And it is positive news because the plant has now been classified as a voluntary action indicated status, which basically means that it's given the green signal to uh, supply to the US. Now, Unit 1 manufactures OTC, which is over-the-counter formulations. Unit 3 manufactures dermatology products or skin products. Now, Unit which were cleared recently by Aurobindo should come up for you. And as a whole, then that becomes a positive piece of news because of Aurobindo uh, simply having a couple of units, in fact, seeing the light of day from the US drug regulator because it had been in the dock for quite a long time. So Unit 9, for example, had an official action indicated status. It was just issued a voluntary action indicated status in Feb of 2022. Unit 11 had a warning letter. It received a VAI status again uh, in November 2022. It's one of their biggest API units. Unit 7 also had an OAI, which is an official action indicated status, and they were issued a voluntary action indicated status in August of 2022, which is their biggest formulation unit, basically giving them the go ahead to go ahead and manufacture for the US. So that's an Aurobindo stock up around a percent and a half. But it was a strong set of